Hello everybody, Matt here. Today we're at Walmart. Let's see what they have for Hot Wheels and I am starting on the pegs. Unfortunately, there was not much for mainlines. I mean, there were a few, but there were some of the older ones. You see the Alpine. So there was some decent finds as you'll see later. And here's the Porsche. But yeah, they only had cars from early in the year. Again, Walmart just hasn't been that good for mainlines ever. It used to be a little better for me when I started doing this. We just see that nice Mustang. Because there was more dump ins. You see the nice Audi Coupe. So, yeah, some good mainlines, but they've been out for a little while now. And I already have them. There was these Top Gun Maverick airplanes. And they did have some Matchbox. It wasn't too much. But I did find a really nice one, as you'll see here in a bit. Check it out, the nice Jaguar F-Type Coupe. I did get that. Very nice casting. So that was a nice find. Down the aisle, you see the matchbox moving parts. And then there was some matchbox by packs, but not much. We do see some matchbox super fast, but all I could find was the Volvo or the older ones. And then there was a lot of Mario Kart items here. You see this Mario Kart Hot Wheels mystery boxes. Kind of interesting, I guess. I mean, they're kind of going all out with it. I mean, I'd rather them focus more on making more car culture stuff or stuff like that. But We do see Hot Wheels ID, but it was only the Mercedes. But I think it's the first time I've ever seen it at Walmart, and other people were saying that Walmart was getting them, so maybe we'll see more in the future. They did have the Stars and Stripes set, and they had a lot of them, which is nice. It's a pretty decent set of cars. You see the Plymouth Duster. And we have the Pontiac GTO. And a nice Chevy Blazer 4x4, and I think that's the first time I've seen that one. But pretty... Pretty fully stocked. You do see the AMC Javelin. It's not bad. So it's kind of nice to see some other stuff after the main lines were disappointing. They did have the Wave 3 of the Cruise Boulevard. We do see the very nice Mercedes-Benz G-Class. Though this was the only one I could find. I was hoping that maybe the Ford GT would be here. But no. We also had the Wild Turning set. And we see a nice Porsche Rally. Or 959. And then they had Fast and Furious Motor City Muscle. You just see the Grand Torino. And the Chevy Nova, but none of the other ones. I still haven't seen the Lightning or the Buick. Who knows if I ever will. We do see a similar larger scale die cast. And there was some Tomica, though not much. 
and just trucks. So, and then there was this M2 Pez. I've never seen that before. Kind of interesting. But yeah, that was pretty much what was here. It's not too much, but some okay stuff. I ended up getting the Jaguar. So thank you for watching this video. Like and subscribe for more. And have a good day.